we need to take this message seriously and pray. Amen. On the 21st of April, 2021, during a prophetic service at Divine Kingdom Baptist Ministries, the Servant of God, Dr. Ian Lovu, gave a prophetic message for Mauritania, urging saints and intercessors to pray for peace. The following are his words. And then the last message that I was given is the message about Mauritania or Mauritania. It's a very small country in West Africa. The, the Holy Spirit is saying we must pray for peace in Mauritania. For peace. Because I'm, I was sensing in the spirit. Because in the spirit I was taken to, to the capital city of Mauritania. I've never been there. And then the Holy Spirit was telling me, I've brought you to, to, to the capital city of Mauritania because there is a transition to a new set of leaders. There is a transition to a new set of what? Of leadership. And then God was telling me in the spirit that as they, they are transitioning to a new set of leadership, we must pray for the transition, number one, to be smooth. Number two, for the transition to be peaceful. Number three, for the transition not to have bloodshed. Not to have what? Bloodshed. And Mauritania, if I'm not mistaken, is an Islamic country. So we must pray for those who believe in Christ to, them, to be God protected. Mauritania's former president, Mohamed Uld Abdelaziz, was jailed on Tuesday night. This decision from a judge in charge of investigating alleged corruption charges comes days after the former president's refusal to report to the police, as was required by the conditions attached to his house arrest. In March, Mohamed Uld Abdelaziz had been charged alongside two former prime ministers and several businessmen of corruption, money laundering and illicit enrichment. The former president of Mauritania said he has been persecuted in a bid to keep him out of politics, but has vowed he will not go into exile. Since he stopped ruling the West African state in 2019, Mohamed Uld Abdelaziz has been investigated for his actions during his 10 years at the head of state, which culminated in a year-long probe that led to assets worth $114 million being seized in March. The Servant of God, Dr. Ian Lovu, urges saints and intercessors to continue to pray for peace and stability in the nation of Mauritania. There is a transition to a new set of what? Of leadership. And then God was telling me in the spirit that as they, they are transitioning to a new set of leadership, we must pray for the transition, number one, to be smooth. Number two, for the transition to be peaceful. Number three, for the transition not to have bloodshed. Not to have what? Bloodshed. 